This episode of Fresh Talk was pre-recorded. If you enjoyed, please give a thumbs up. Enjoy the video. Swa 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 raffle 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 raffle. This is Fresh Talk. Hey guys, welcome to another pre-recorded episode of Fresh Talk. Today I'm talking about a new animated show to go alongside me and father. Here's the teaser trailer. Well, sorry for the low quality picture, but the trailer was taken using the stop motion app on my VTech Kitty Zoom action cam. I got the idea for Snoot the Dinosaur when I got these multicolored plastic dinosaur figurines. In the center of all these toys is the main character, Snoot, which is this green apatosaurus right here. The orange apatosaurus's name is Naranja, meaning orange in Spanish. This blue T-Rex is named Rex. These are the red Sorolophus twins, Beaker and Duckward. This blue Sorolophus is the mother of the twins, Alicia. This green Pteranodon is named Terry. And last but not least, the red one. Now, I don't really know the species of this one, but I call him Joey. These dinosaurs live on a fictional Latin island called Birth, which is located near the coast of Mexico. If you take a look at my globe, Mexico is located right here, and I want to put Birth near the coast, so I'm just gonna place it right here. Right near Cancun. And they're all prehistoric creatures in modern times, kind of like the Flintstones. Now Snoot is scheduled for release on YouTube near the end of next year, and if it's still in the works, like me and father is now, through all of 2019, I might have to postpone it. And there's much more to Snoot than I can possibly cover today, but right now I don't have to. So I'll just see how Mr. Selfish Pants Bear is up to, despite the fact that he only wears a shirt, like Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> there he is, we Dr. Seuss's Horton, here's a who. Later. What is he doing in my parents' bedroom? No. No, not that. What the heck are you doing up here? Nothing. I was just chilling out. But what are you doing up here? Why did I tell you about that camera last night? I didn't want it or your computer around here. What are you doing? Well, nothing. Oh, you I think you're getting your ukulele back? No, sir. I was just vlogging my animations. I'm doing my job, right? On my own, like always. Yeah, by yourself and only by yourself. Not including me. You understand that? I don't want to be in your garbage film. You didn't know I was filming this, did you? Yeah, but why are you sneaking up on me? Get your carcass in your room. That's your only spot in this house you're doing your videos and animation. I don't want what? the computer or the camera around me. What do you mean? That's why I like to just get the heck downstairs now. Let's go! I don't want the computer or the camera around me. I don't want to be in your film or your animation. Bar none. It's only a vlog. Well, if you want to do it, you do it in your room. And only in your room. So wait, I'm not even allowed to film anywhere in the house? No! In your room! Get that computer and camera away from me. Well, that's just garbage. I don't want garbage. any more parts of this. This is all about you, and you can make money. I know you can make money, Caleb. I can, sir. I can. 
But you do it by yourself only in your trashy room. This is a vlog. A vlog captures your everyday life. Yeah, that everyday life is yours. Not mine. You're part of it. I don't want to be part of it. You drove everyone around you, including me, to madness with your rotten videos. So I don't want to be part of your everyday life. It's all about you. It's always about you. Well, if I'm going to the bathroom, keep your camera off. And if I'm eating and stuff like that, just do it in your room. I want everything about you and in your room always. So I can't film myself eating? No! <sighs> well, this sucks. Well, I may not be able to film outside my room, but at least I got video games. You see, I've got this NES Classic Edition right here. And in case I want to watch TV, I've got that, and a Blue Sky TV box from Shaw. I also have an Apple TV from Christmas 2014. And if I want to watch stuff from my hard drive, I've got that too. Even because the destruction of the hard drive by Sergeant Grizzly was fake. But I can't use it on this TV. Because it's old, and the USB port on this TV is for service updates only. So I've got only my computer for right now. But I've got to figure out how to get back my uke. To help me out, I'm going to call Mr. Emoji Head up through my DSi Picta chat. And now that I've texted him, he says, I'll be here in 20 minutes. Twenty minutes later. He's here. I'll just open my window. Hey, what's up, Caleb? So, where did you park your car? Oh, I just parked it behind the hot tub in the backyard. It's a radio controlled car, so it's not as big as a regular sized car. So, you can't leave your room anymore? Well, I can, but not while I'm filming. I can't film outside my room. I can't even use my computer or create my animations outside my room either. I'm restricted to film in this area and only in this area. And I'm sorry you got kicked out. Well, thanks for apologizing. Like, he restricted me to homeschooling. He destroyed my basement TV for watching Phineas and Ferb in European Spanish. He tried to drown my computer in the water, but threw me in the pool instead. He shredded my animation and video tools with my dad's lawnmower. He drowned my Phineas and Ferb DVDs. He destroyed my scooter, he shredded my drawings, and he destroyed my hard drive for watching Phineas and Ferb in European Spanish again. But that didn't really happen, because it's only a video. That bear is exactly like my late mom, because he's a selfish, lazy, abusive psychopath. Yeah, so I parked the car where he won't see it. I hope he doesn't catch me coming into your room. I would agree. So... Would you like to hold the camera for my vlogs? Sure, sure. Okay, I'll just open my window so you can come in. <sighs> this is some unusual transportation around here, especially for anthropomorphic stuffed toys like you. Agreed, man. Agreed. So I just don't want you damaging my stuff, alright? What the heck are you doing, Mr. Emoji? Didn't I make myself clear last night? I thought you wouldn't sneak up on me every time I try to do something. You're gone, man! Get off my property right now! Oh no, Sarge. 
No, 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 no. I've got to get emoji head right now. Sarge, no. Sarge, stop chasing him! This is all wrong. No, 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 no. Sarge! Oh, I'm tired of being kicked around by that blue collar idiot. I'm coming. I'm coming, Emoji Head. Hey, what's up? Where are you at, Smiley? I'm just in the backyard next door. Which house next door? Where Ginger the dog lives? Or where Charlie the dog lives? At Charlie's. That's where I live. I just hope that Charlie doesn't come outside to use you as his chew toy. Oh, I'm sure he won't. That's why I'm in the tree above the fence. Up in the tree? Now where's Sergeant Grizzly at? Well, he chased me into the yard and he went back inside. Okay, you're alright. I thought he was going to hit you with a shovel. He's really crazy, you know. I know. Well, you can come with me if you want. But the car is too small for me to ride. It's a radio-controlled toy car. That's okay. You can take my invisible helicopter and I can fly you to Coelho and Luke's house for us to stay. Alright, but first I need to go get my stuff. And I'll go get mine. <gasps> Uh-oh, it's Sergeant Grizzly. What the... He's right behind me, isn't he? Would you turn around and look at me? Caleb! Would you turn around and look at me? Didn't I make it clear? About what? I told you how many times I didn't want you filming or doing your animations outside your room. But you disobeyed that order, didn't you? I don't understand why you don't ever listen to me. You do it deliberately just to tick me off. I listen to you, sir. It's just that you've changed the rules of my family just so that you could act like my mom. Excuse me? You dare mention that woman in my presence? I'm telling you, mister, if I hear anything about your mom in my presence, you will be out on your ear. You hear me? Come on, let's go back inside. But sure. Now! Stay out of it, Smiley. Let's go back in the house now. Well, sure, I was just You're in doing... enough trouble as it is, and now you tell me that? Have Emoji Head film me, Dad, and Marie, and my dirty laundry, and his dirty laundry, and her dirty laundry, and put it all out on the freaking internet? Cause that's part of my job. I'm not happy with you. Not happy. Come on! Get your conscience back in the house! Say goodbye, your friend. You'll never see him again. Sarge, you can't- No! That's it! I'm just sick of it. I don't need it. Take your stuff off. I got new rules for you, maggot. That's garbage. I'm gonna do my animation in my bedroom and everything, you too. You know what this is called? Yeah, that's the secondary entrance to the crawl space. Yeah, and this crawl space that leads to, I call it Caleb Dirksen Productions. Now get in there! What are you talking about, Sarge? What do you mean? That's where all your film and animation work is done from now on. Right in here. Ah, so I go in my bedroom here in the crawl space. This is where all the stuff that we don't know what You're to do You're not doing with. those things in your bedroom. Not in my yard. Not anywhere in my barracks, not in school, and not in my face! You hear that? It's all on that? Zip It, Happy Meal! It's all on you. You need independence. Grow up quicker. Be a man. Yeah, this isn't independence, sir. This By is independence, I mean on your own. You expect me to do my projects in the crawl space? It's all dark in here if it's not lit up. In fact, there's a switch at the main entrance to the crawl space. It doesn't matter. You leave it on, the electric bill is yours to pay. Alright, you know what? Whatever. You're not going to have gonna anybody this. here to help you anymore, and all the cronies of yours are not welcome here anymore. You hear me? Do you hear me? Yes, sir. 
You look at the drill sergeant when he's talking to you. You got it made. A roof over your head, you've got me off, and then comes a room like this. Exactly. A room as wide as a cave. Then consider making it work. You hear me? Sure, yes, sir. You want to make a living? Sure, yes, sir. You want to be big in this area? Sure, yes, sir. Then you got to, got to make it work like money, man. Come up with an idea for a project. Yeah, so And the why? number one rule, keep that computer, and especially your camera, out of my face. If I see those again, I will send your dad to come here and smash those on the ground, you hear me? Yeah! He will carry them and smash them into little pieces on the ground and you'll never get your stuff back. You can't expect me to do new Fresh Talk videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday in the crawl space. Besides, I do three new ones on no, these days. No, you ain't doing three videos. You got one a day and only one. Only on Mondays. One video on Mondays only? That's right! Only one video! Only on Mondays! And the next video you upload, I will find that on your channel! I will murder your YouTube channel! I've seen a whole lot of videos on your channel that have embarrassed this whole family! Well, of course everyone agrees with Shut my- Shut up! You can your mouth for the rest of this conversation! You've embarrassed your family and your classmates by putting all that garbage on your channel. This is all about you, as always. One on Monday is all you got. Got it? Yes, sir. I'm tired of this garbage. You gotta grow up faster and be a man, Caleb. That's right. Be independent, grow up, be a man, Reflect on what you've done in the past like you own it. I'm not perfect, and I know everything about you. You do not. You know nothing about me. You act like Shut it. Shut up right now! All you want to do is have everybody do everything for you. Ruin your dad's marriage with your garbage videos. Manipulate my- Why do you my... blame me for everything? All you're Shut doing up. is blaming me for everything. It's blame because it you can't- It is blame because I'm leaving it's blame on you. So you own it, grow up, make it work. Oh gosh. I'm tired of it, Caleb. The computer is out all the time. And so is your camera. And your animation supplies. Now here's a bet. I'm gonna make a bet. You're gonna make a bet? Alright, let's hear it, Sarge. Within one to two weeks... Uh-huh. You're not gonna be able to do this because you're gonna need help from all the people around you. I've done it for almost eight years. Yeah! With the help of everyone! Before that, you were homeschooled, so you did it all on your own. Now it's time you did it all on your own once again. Grow up already! And within one to two weeks, you'll be coming to me, and I'll have to let you scrub floors and shovel snow with me. I will be your boss, really? your new manager, and you'll be working for me. Really? Possibly two weeks. So why And I, I will manage and control you like a robot. I just want my stuff while I last. I'm the one who will make that decision when you get it back. You hear me? Yes, sir. Look me in the eye! When I make that decision, you will get back. But until then, it's two weeks for you. Two! Now straighten out! Grow up faster! Smarten up! Be a big boy! The camera's got its eyes on you right now. Yeah, I know, and this is the last time its eyes will ever be on me. You hear my lips? No more! If I see your computer or your camera again, it's gone. Along with all your other stuff. Sorry, fire upon you, I have to get to work. Fire upon you, don't even start badness with me. I really need to get to- Don't talk to me that way and disrespectfully in my barracks. You'll be out on your ear. You hear me? Alright, well I need to get to work. Just do it! I won't let my dreams be dreams! 
Well guys, this is where I'll be filming in the future, even though today's fresh talk was pre-recorded. But the other pre-recorded episodes are being done just about anywhere. But there's one additional update I need to make on the number of episodes in Fresh Talk, bringing the total up to 23. Anyway, that's all for this episode. Thanks for watching, keep it locked for more Fresh Talk, give a thumbs up if you enjoyed, and I'll see you in another pre-recorded episode of Fresh Talk. Bye. Subscribe for more Manor Mania, or check out these other videos from Manor Mania too!